What we value is a book about how our brain makes decisions and how we might use our brains to see more possibilities for ourselves and for other people, um, change our own behavior, and maybe change society. I think a lot of us struggle with making sense of our own decisions, like why did I go out dancing instead of study for that exam or prepare for the presentation that I needed to make it work? Or why did I skip that event that I knew would be good for my career but like seemed a little bit boring in the moment? When we think about those kinds of choices, it can be really helpful to understand how our brain's value system is actually calculating value. So these value calculations that our brain is making take inputs from lots of different systems, including emotional processing systems, rational decision-making systems, our sense of who we are and what other people think and feel, and it weighs them in a value calculation that prioritizes things like our short-term rewards. So the me that's right here, right now, is treated differently in our brain than the me that exists in the future. And when we understand how that value calculation is working by default, we can work with it rather than against it. In doing this research, it seemed clear that a lot of the choices that people are making come down to how they see themselves and how they connect with other people. If people understood how their brains were making these decisions, it might give them more agency, more of a sense of autonomy, and more of a sense of possibility in what's available when they're making choices for themselves and for other people. As an analogy, many of us can cook a basic meal, but when we understand the chemistry behind what we're cooking, it can make it easier to get creative, to come up with new recipes or try different things than we would have otherwise thought of. It can also make it easier to swap out ingredients when we don't have what they're looking for on hand or to diagnose what went wrong if a cooking project goes awry. When you understand how your brain works, it also gives you a sense that we don't make choices in isolation. The context that's around us matters. The people that are around us matter. And so when we understand the things that are going into it, it can help us make choices in a different way. I think the other thing that I'm hoping that people will walk away with is a little bit more compassion for themselves about why we've made the choices that we made in the past, the reasons that other people are making the choices that they're making, and how we might be able to get on the same page when it's hard to do that, and also where we might be able to explore new possibilities or directions together.